Tom Hanks plays a grumpy old man in the film A Man Called Otto. I don't believe you. Let's see if this film is worth your time. Hey everybody, my name is Justin here. I try to watch everything that hits theaters and on streaming services. If you guys are like me, make sure to subscribe button down below for more up and coming content. And I hope everybody is enjoying 2023 so far. When a lively young family moves in next door, grumpy Otto Anderson meets his match in a quick-witted pregnant woman named Marisol, leading to an unlikely friendship that turns his world upside down. Tom Hanks is a great actor and we've always seen him take on these roles that just are so lighthearted and he's such a great guy. Here, he plays a grumpy old man that wants nothing to do with his neighbors, doesn't like when someone drives down his street, has to shovel the snow, doesn't want cats around him. He is grumpy and that's just his character. But when you establish this character as someone that hates a lot of things, the only way that you can go is up and have progression for this character and start to understand why is he so grumpy and hates a lot of things a man called Otto was a heartwarming film I enjoyed this movie for the progression of the character and the unlikely friendship along the way the new neighbor is played by Mariana Trevino and she doesn't like that he is so grumpy and really challenges him and calls him out on his behavior throughout the film he starts to tell the story of what happened to him and his wife when they met and there's a lot of flashbacks to when they did first meet and it eventually leads to her death and that shows why he is so grumpy so we have to peel back this character and understand his story and where he is coming from and the more that marisol pushes this character and gets involved in his life the more he does open up so the character of otto is growing throughout the film and the character of marisol is also growing throughout the film and their relationship is being tested and it does flourish into something really beautiful within this film i love the change of character in otto and those flashbacks and marisol as well really contributed a lot to this story and the character development and it turned out to be just something absolutely sweet mariana trevino in here is fabulous i love her character in here she's quick-witted she's stubborn she doesn't take no for an answer she doesn't put up with otto's crap at all are you always this unfriendly i am not unfriendly okay you're not every word you say is like a warm cuddle I love that relationship and the conflict they had at times, but also it brought out the softer side of Otto within the film. Truman Hanks, Tom Hanks' son, plays a younger version of Otto, and with those flashbacks and him meeting his wife, we see that more bubbly, lively character and that progression to why he got so angry and where he is at now. Now, this film has all of the potential and a story to be really emotional. When you look at the character and those dramatic scenes with his wife and him being so upset with life and wanting to be with his wife, it has all of the elements to be a film that could be a tearjerker. And it has the right score, the film is directed well, the performances are good, but I just didn't really connect emotionally with this film. I felt it, I felt all of those emotional sequences but I think it didn't hit me as much as I anticipated it would. When watching this film and seeing those flashbacks and the progression of Otto in the film and the relationship that is developing within this film, I expected a little more emotion to it. It works for what it's trying to do, but I think that it could have been a little deeper. And that's the main problem for this film. I think at the end, it tries to do a little too much. It tries to show and really push this character Otto into being a nice guy. If it's him being interviewed by a journalist for what he did and him trying to protect his home and everything, I think it takes on a little too much at the end and it takes away from some of the more deeper moments with him and his neighbor in those flashback scenes as well because the potential is there to be a really emotional film but it just is not quite there. 
But overall, A Man Called Otto is a heartwarming film. Tom Hanks plays a great character. He does a great job as this grumpy old man and that progression to being a nice, welcoming person. I love that story. It is a film worth watching. I love Mariana Trevino in here and her relationship with Tom Hanks and that development and that chemistry they had. It really did work within this film. I just wish the end would have been a little more emotional and take on a little less because there was potential for a really deep story. So before I give you my score for A Man Called Otto, make sure to check out my channel. Here I do movie reviews, trailer actions, ranking videos, tier lists, all that fun movie related content that you see on YouTube. I do it all here. So hit that subscribe button to get it all in one spot. If you'd like to see where A Man Called Otto ranks amongst all the 2022 releases since I did see it last year, follow me on letterbox and there you can find my ranking i'm gonna go ahead and give a man called otto a b minus thank you guys for checking my review for a man called otto have you guys seen it by chance what do you think about it let me know in the comment section down below and stay tuned for more up and coming content like this my name is just watches movies and you guys stay classy youtube